Yo, what up, YouTube? Zan the Great 35 here. I'll uh, come back at you again. Uh, it's gonna be my first episode of uh, Stupid E Bears. E Bears being stupid, whatever you want to call it. But uh, I just find these pretty funny. Uh, so, what I'm gonna do is there's six links I found of E Bears stupidity. Uh, comment down below which one you think is the most stupid or your favorite one. And, uh,. Whichever one gets the most votes, I'll raffle everyone who uh, typed in that one, and then I'll send them a nice little care package of uh, some jerseys, autographs, inserts, whatnot. So yeah, first up, 1992 Bowman baseball case, 16 boxes, 36 packs, 15 cards. The guy wants $2,075. First of all, that's ridiculous. Uh, that's a lot of money. You could probably buy like a case of exquisite for that much money, but um, let's see. He says in this case you can get rookie cards of Trevor Hoffman that probably sell for fifty cents. Uh, Derek Lowe, Carlos Delgado, Troy Perasival, Garrett Anderson, Mariano Rivera. Yeah, and those rookie cards probably sell for fifty cents to a dollar. And he wants two thousand dollars for a stupid case. Uh, yeah, I just think that's pretty idiotic, in my opinion. You could probably get it for around, you could probably get a box for about like 20 bucks on online or something. But yeah, $2,000 is just a lot of money. Uh, number two, Eric Jeter rookie card. Uh, let me try to focus this. I am. They sell for probably about ten dollars on eBay. You could probably get it at your show for around five, ten dollars. Yeah, something like that. Uh, he wants ten thousand dollars for it. I understand he just hit the three thousand home run club. I mean three thousand hit club, but ten thousand dollars for a stupid rookie card. It's probably most common rookie card that goes for around like five, ten bucks. And uh, let's see what he wrote in the description. Derek Jeter rookie baseball card. Yeah, okay, that's real nice. Uh, that just, that's just a bunch of, yeah, I'm not going to swear, but that is just pretty stupid. Of course, no one's going to bid. All right, next one, number three. Fleer Legacy, 1998 Masterpiece, Matt Morris, one of one card. Uh, I know some of these are actually worth some money. Uh, I know basketball has some of these, and they're pretty rare, but uh, first of all, I'm not even sure this is a one of one. It might not even be a one one I mean, it says one one right there. Let's see. Let's zoom in. This is the. This is one one masterpiece. Uh, he wants three thousand two hundred dollars for it. That's ridiculous. Cause first of all, I've never even heard of Matt Morris. Who knows where he is? You can go look him up on. And uh, that's probably not a one one. No one probably needs that card. And uh. I don't know. He just says that he pulled it from a pack and put it into a case. Yeah, I don't know. That just. No, I'm sorry, but that's just stupid. No one's gonna buy that. Uh. But at least he included free shipping, you know? Alright, next one. It's a rare Daryl Palmer Tops card. Uh, the guy wants two thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars for it. In just a tops card. Uh, I don't know much about this set, but supposedly he says you won't find it in this set. It's from a movie that was produced by. This card was produced by Tops for a movie. Uh, I've never even heard of the guy, so uh, it's probably some actor in the movie or something who's not even. I don't know. But whatever, that card's probably worth nothing. No one even cares about him. That's prob that's an unpopular set. There's, uh, it's not an expensive set. I know there are some popular cards in that set, but um, three thousand dollars. That card, that's just ridiculous. But again, free shipping. You can't beat it. All right, we have two more to go. This one, complete sixty card, two thousand eleven top sparkle set. Thousand eight hundred ninety nine dollars. Um, free shipping too. If you can see, it's just the Sparkle set from Tops from recently. 
I'm pretty sure 60 cards isn't even the whole set. Uh, his one per case. Uh, I'm pretty sure this guy has no idea what he's talking about. Uh, yeah, so I think this set's like 150 cards. I'm not positive, but again, a thousand, two thousand dollars approximately for this. Just some inserts that are come in every pack. That's kind of ridiculous. But again, free shipping too. You can't beat it. And lastly, uh, it's pretty funny. It's not really a card or anything, but I think Kingo for life. If you're watching this, Bo, you'll get a laugh out of this. But LeBron James Antique Crapper Outhouse Toilet Latrine. The guy wants a million dollars for it. Obviously a joke. Free shipping. Um. So yeah, there's a picture right there. Let me see if I can. Yeah, just an outhouse with LeBron on it. So it's a pretty funny. I got a video here on YouTube. I'm gonna play it for you real quick. Hey, how you doing? Okay, this is my eBay sale going up tonight. I'm putting it on tonight, everybody. It's a LeBron James antique crapper. Now what this is, it's it's really nice wood, as you can see. You gotta pick this up because I'm not gonna deliver this because all the, the it's gonna cost too much. We'll take a look in there real quick. Uh huh. All right, enough of that. But uh, pick up only. Oh, uh, this is kind of funny. No one's gonna buy it. Obviously, it's just a joke. This guy probably hates LeBron. Uh, but uh, Kingo, if you're watching this, you should just pick this up and burn it. Just my opinion, but uh, yeah. So uh, those are the six uh, eBayers listings, whatnot. Uh, yeah. So uh, comment down below which one you think is the worst one of them all, and uh, maybe you'll win some free cards. And then uh, PM me if you have any ideas for next week's stupid eBayers, and uh, maybe I'll show the listing on on the next episode or whatever. Alright, that's it. Peace out.